Welcome to SIT. When you're in SIT, you must always do your tutorials. That's right. Bring your jacket, actually jacket, umbrella and water bottle. Let's go to class early because you know if you come late and you normally end up sitting right in front near the professor or you end up sitting right at the back where you can't get a good view. Never procrastinate in SIT. You've only got 12 weeks in a trimester. Uh, you should not leave everything to the last minute. Plan your time properly. One thing that you shouldn't do, skip lectures. Never be selfish. There will always be people in uni who don't teach or don't help your classmates. It's important because one day you're going to need the help back. Don't ever say no to anyone because you don't know who they might be in the future. You should get a planner because it gets hectic. You got a lot of assignments, you got a lot of projects, a lot of commitments. Make sure you hand in your assignments, get every percentage that you can and study early for your exams. Just be aware of your deadline, project submissions. I think as a freshman, just be outgoing. I think I would have been more outgoing. I think I would have tried to make more friends and step out of my comfort zone. Google textbooks online. Googling textbooks online, you will get the questions from your tutorials. You will get the answers for your tutorials. Print my notes at home, prepare myself before each lesson. As a freshman, I was very shy so I didn't really join a lot of CCAs. But then now that I think about it, right, I should have joined a lot of CCAs. I think I would explore all the CCAs. I would try to find out more from their social media page because there's a lot of clubs that I actually don't know of and that I actually want to join. A lot of people would say time management but I would actually like invest more in CCAs and spending, maxing out my time. SIT is different from other universities because we've got a very high teacher to student ratio or prof to student ratio. They are your best friends. Leverage on them, confide in them, and they will help you. I think your professors are very important to you. They're not just there to teach you, they are more like your mentors and your friends also. If you see them around the canteen, please do not shy away from them. One secret tip is that the power of your matric card. Because you don't have to necessarily come to main campus over. You can actually go to the nearby satellite campus of SIT to actually do your project work. Each campus has their own unique facility and like let's say the BR rooms in NYP is huge but then RP is very quiet for you to study. Very often we get caught up in work and when you get too engrossed in work sometimes we don't realise that we can be a bit harsh on our peers. I just want to hope that every SIT student doesn't let studies or group projects come between friendships. That's very important.